Hi everyone, this is Lorraine. So, um, because I changed my hair color, I needed a new scent. And scent is very, very important. People will be turned off by you, by your scent, or they will be turned on to you by your scent. I love when I smell a man wearing cologne. It just makes him that much more attractive. Because guys don't typically wear cologne. They sometimes forget that cologne is a very important necessity in life. Um, but scent is powerful. Scent can do strange things to people. Um, it makes people have strong emotions. So because of the changed hair color, I thought it was time for a new scent. Um, I also collect perfume. So um, that I just love perfume bottles. Um, so if you can recommend other things to me, I would be really, really happy. Um, I changed my hair color. I went on Twitter and I went on Facebook and I said, what is a good perfume? So I got tons of replies, which I loved. So um, one of the perfumes I picked up was this Victor and Rolf, um, and it is in Flower Bomb. And I got the refillable one. Um, chances are I won't refill this because I like to change it up a lot. I've been using this one a lot. Um, comes with a little, you know, little refill. I guess they bought this at Nordstrom. They refill it there for $80 or something. You could just buy another perfume for $80. You could probably, I don't know how much this was. So, but I love this one. This is my, by far my favorite one that I picked up, um, while I was perfume shopping. So I got that, the flower bomb, which is the packaging. I'm all about packaging. You can recommend your favorite perfumes below. Um, that makes me really happy because I think perfume is a step above makeup. Um, next, I purchased, this is such a huge box. This is Marc Jacobs in Lola. And what's cool about this, it just, I don't know, it's just, it's very, like, it looks like salsa-y, you know, very cute. Um, I think this is actually the smaller version because I didn't think I needed the bigger version of it. Um, smells good too. They all smell delicious, but I probably, this isn't a scent that I'll wear. I don't know, I like it, but the smell is not me. And when you find a perfume, it reminds me of a friend of mine, and I think she would like this much more than I would, so maybe I'll just let her borrow it and make me her give me back the bottle because I'm all about collecting the perfume bottles so favorite perfume bottles let me know then the last one that I picked up was Dolce & Gabbana um, did new like I think there are five new perfumes that they did and they all look like this they're all slightly different I chose number 18 La Lune I believe would be how it's pronounced I could be wrong so please um, phonetically tell me how I spell it um, came in just a regular basic bottle. This is the most boring of all the ones that I've picked up. Um, but it actually came with something else, and I haven't even opened this. Let's see what it came with, actually. Oh, I guess it came with samples of the... Well, I, well, I think it's supposed to come with samples of the four other ones that you didn't purchase. Um but it came with a sample of this, which is good because this is, I love, it's always nice to have um, one of the mini little things so you can put in your handbag. So if you want to spray yourself, so it's a good idea if you're buying a perfume um, to ask them if they have a sample of the perfume as well because then you can carry it in your handbag as you're just kind of to freshen up if you ever need to freshen up. But this one was my favorite, the Lulune, number 18. Um, these are actually unisex, so they were for male and female. Um, this one, I have a perfume video. I never wear just one perfume. I always mix it with two. Um, this is very musky. Um, it smells more manly than it does feminine to me, um, but I actually like the scent of a man because it's very sexy. Um, so I would just probably mix this with something like my Burberry Beat. Burberry Beat makes a good mixer for like everything. This is just such a good smelling perfume. 
but they have like four more options of this and they're very cool that they have like one's kind of a blue color one's kind of a green color um, I just love scent scent is very important and you can't you can't listen to me when I say my favorite scent is this it might not be your favorite scent you have to pick up you have to actually the thing about perfume is you have to actually physically smell the perfume to determine whether that one is the one for you or not and just you know just to let you all know when I was um when I was going to the perfume store um, I stopped in Neiman Marcus and they have a Chanel in Neiman Marcus and I picked up these earrings because um, this is all about being my new me with my new hair color and everything. And you can't, there, the camera doesn't want to pick it up, but it's got um, crystals and little pearl, probably not real pearls, um, but little Chanel earrings. Really pretty. And that's all. <laughs> but I just really wanted, I did this video more not to show you the perfumes that I bought, but to ask you. Um, what is your favorite perfume? Because it's interesting to me. It's so interesting to me. I love to look at perfumes. I love to find new scents. And I found all of these new scents by people's suggestions on Twitter and Facebook. So um, if you'd like to follow me on Twitter, feel free to follow me. I'm trying to update it more. I kind of got distracted by blog TV. And I need to go back to Twitter because Twitter is very fun. And um, Facebook, you know, Facebook's Facebook. So... Um, thank you all for watching me, and I'll see you all very soon. Okay, bye.